this will be a non typical come on where are you going in 2025 guys if you're in the market for a power supply uh, currently you're better off with the ATX 3.1 it's a new iteration of the 3.0 it has better transient response works better with power spikes uh, this 12 pH power connector was uh, rethought remade a little bit has different power limits so it works better so the problem with melting power connectors that was present in the 3.0 is not that prominent on this 3.1 however it may still happen on some very very power hungry cards but this particular small comparison i'm doing right now is uh, around some older seasonic models like seasonic prime ultra and a rebranding they did with the tx px gx series so small comparison older power supplies you may still buy them used you may still buy them new however i wouldn't recommend 3.1 is much better when you're buying something new but used those are amazing and seasonic warranty is like 12 years so people who bought them long time ago still may use them and they are still perfectly fine so let's see the small comparison what's so new and what's so different with the new seasonic series of power supplies got a small little knife here from my childhood good and we see there is some little cosmetic difference this one has been opened before so there was a sack of this sort inside you may use it for whatever purposes you may want to use it and there were cables inside manuals and a testing unit that you basically use to test the power supply without the motherboard this is the type of velcro that been used before on prime ultra series and it's quite good it's a little bit wide as you see so these are a little bit more narrow the stickiness seems to be exactly the same they are definitely more narrow and that's a good thing guys because having something this wide in a case is not necessarily a good thing maybe strong but i mean having something narrow and black i think is better so yeah, one point to Gryffindor. This one is better. What else? The heart of your system. Seasonic power supply installation guide. Cables, same testing unit here. Different set of cables. So you may check it online. They have the full description. What's different? Primarily the length. The length of the cables and some configurations is a little bit different, but it's so minor, it's so insignificant that actually no much need to talk about it yeah there's the power supply so we've got 750 on the left we've got 1000 on the right and from the visual perspective i mean there is not much different of course the sticker is different they changed the naming convention they changed the sticker some numbers are different because this 1000 and this is 750 of course but apart from that looks very similar some arrangement maybe a bit different but very 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 similar yeah two of those side by side same buttons same everything of course the t1000 has a little bit extra connections because it uses more power so it may use a little bit more lanes but apart from that very very similar boxes read lots of reviews and uh, I mean the technical specification and the actual tests show the same number so basically this is a rebranding and the advice would be get whatever is cheaper get whatever is cheaper in your region subjectively i haven't actually measured the weight but they even feel the same by the weight i mean this is supposed to be more heavy this 1000 but they feel exactly the same so a very subjective review guys thanks for watching andre's reviews See you next time. Wee! Oui.